Welcome everybody, my name is Marcus Stone and in this video I will show you a simple way how you can use Motion Ninja. So let's start. The first thing you want to do is just be in like your Motion Ninja and now just create a new project. Right here, I will just OK, allow it. And I get like all the videos here, so I'm going to choose this video. And I can choose this video, like two videos, and just click Add. Now here you can also add the pictures if you want to. And voila, now you can see like, oh my God, so many things here. So do is like, these things are really simple. So what do you want to do? You can simply cut it here. So I'm going to create a new video if you want, if I want the first thing, then I can go like back on left down corner. You saw it. You can like, let's go with the start. You can just click plus here. to add a new video if you want to. Then this don't even do that. Now, when I'm going to click, I can edit the video. So I can get like, I don't know, some filters here. Some chroma. I can create keyframes and I can add shadows. Then I have like basic here that I can rotate the video and stuff like that and add filters here. It's like up to you if you want to. Then you can copy it, you can reverse the video. So many things to do. Now here, you're gonna see like the clip here. Yep, that's what we did right now. Now we get like mixer. You get a text here that you can add text. One, two, three. And I'm just making bigger with my two fingers. It's like really simple. I can change the font, the mask and everything, the animation here. It's like these things are really simple. Like everyone can do that. I'm not going to speak about it that much. I can make it longer the text. Then you get like stickers here that you can add also really simple, really easy. Audio voice, voice over filter. Again, audio. Vlog. Or you can extract music from video if you have any music. Now you're going to see voice over that you can add filters. Again, you can add filters right directly on part of the videos. And then you're going to see effects. Then you can like add a shake effect. Or wobble. And yeah, or glitch even. So yeah, this is how we do it. And then you can just easily export the video. And that you got it. So thank you very much everybody for watching. If you have any questions guys, ask me down in the comments. Like these things are really easy. Really simple. Thank you very much everybody. And yeah. This is how we do it. So have a great day and goodbye.